Welcome to Spiritual and Ambitious. I'm your host, Whitney McNeil. I'm a certified medium and spiritual teacher, and I help spiritual and ambitious souls just like you live your life purpose through your career and attract abundance by connecting into your intuition and spirit guide. Let's get spiritual and ambitious. Welcome to a special bonus episode of the Spiritual and Ambitious Podcast. So March is my birthday month, and I want to give you the gift. So what I'm going to be doing is every Sunday in March, I am going to be pulling some cards and telling you the energy of the week that's coming in. Now, if you are listening to this and it's been months and you're like, oh, I missed it, please know that whenever you hear these messages, they are meant for you in that time. So I am tuning into the energy of March 5th, 2023, this week. So not just the day, but for the week and giving you some messages that spirit feels like you need to hear. And I want to share them with you. But I want to say too, if you love this podcast, I'd love for you to share with a friend. I'd love for you to give me a five-star review. I'd love for you to make sure you're subscribed. So if you're on YouTube, you can subscribe to the channel. If you're an Apple, Spotify, wherever you are. I'd love for you just to subscribe so that you never miss an episode. Now, of course, this month we're doing our regular Wednesday episodes, but this is going to be a quick little mini for you. Okay, so the first card that I have here is the card of the deer. Slow down and give yourself grace. This card has been on the podcast before. And I always tell my students that work with me, what do you notice on the card? You know, what pops out there for you? So you can see this card over on YouTube, but I'm going to share the message here. And it feels like this week is time for you to slow down, give yourself grace, take a deep breath. You might start feeling the energy of spring. Like I got to go. I got to do all the things. Boom, boom, boom. And just breathe. (laughs) Allow yourself to breathe. Allow yourself to just feel into what you need to be doing. So I always recommend to my students, tune into your spirit guides every day and say, what are my three big items that I need to do for today? Because what's on your to-do list might not be what your energy needs. So slow down, take a couple breaths. It's okay. We don't have to just kind of come out of the gate running. The next card I have here is the card of the higher self. And this is your life purpose is calling. So with this, I really would encourage you to tune into your higher self. And when you tune into your higher self, this is the part of you that's always connected, that can see the journey, see where you're going and where you've been and knowing why you're here. So really listen in. I would do more meditating with this card because when this comes up, it's more of a, I need to access knowledge that my brain doesn't have. I need to connect with my knowledge from spirit. But this is also welcoming your life purpose. Listen in. When you slow down, you hear the messages more clearly and your life purpose is trying to come in as best they can. Now, The card over here for higher self adds up to a nine, which is ending cycles, completion, closing. So some things may need to come to an end so you can move forward fully, which brings me to our next card. And it's the throat chakra. Speak your truth. This is be authentic. Allow yourself to shine. And this adds up to a five, which is all about change. So what in your life needs change? What are you not speaking up for? And really, I feel like slow down, tune into who you are, really call in the support of your higher self and really feel into your purpose, what you love, what your inherent natural abilities are, and then communicate it with the world. But really, to me, this is being authentic. Like where in your life have you not been authentic? It's time to make sure this week specifically, I'm being authentic and real. And that might mean, no, I'm not going to the party. No, I don't want to go to dinner. No, I can't help you right now. And one of the things I've learned from my friend, Miriam Shulman, she came up with a phrase, I can't make this a priority right now, which I think is brilliant. So take that if you want to. And actually shout out to Miriam Shulman at the inspiration place for that. So really, those are the messages here today. And if you are interested in the cards, you can find them over at messengerspirit.com forward slash cards. I'll link to them in the show notes. But this month, we are doing a free Spirit Guide Masterclass. So if you've not taken the Spirit Guide Masterclass, you are going to want to check that out. MessengerSpirit.com forward slash class. I'm celebrating my birthday by giving you gifts. 
And I'd love to know how these messages resonated with you. You can find me over on Instagram at Messenger of Spirit. So we are going to see you, right? When I say we, me and my spirit guides, we're going to see you on Wednesday for our regular episodes. But until then, here's to staying spiritual and ambitious. Thanks so much for listening to this episode. And if you loved it, would you please share it with a friend? I would also love your review and a reminder to subscribe so you never miss an episode. You can find me at messengerspirit.com and you can take the four intuitive languages quiz and find show notes there too. If you want to connect on YouTube, Facebook, or Instagram, you can find me at messenger of spirit. I'll meet you right here next week. Here's to stand spiritual and ambitious. This podcast is part of the Sound Advice FM network. Sound Advice FM, women's voices amplified.